in mm -hmm. from the Atlantic. We can see the clouds here. Plenty of rain coming out of that cloud as well, particularly across Northern Ireland and Scotland just at the moment. Now, there is a clearer slot way up in the far north, but that's going to fill in as the rain pushes back from the south in the next couple of hours. So quite heavy rain to come then for Scotland and Northern Ireland tonight. The whole rain band pushing southwards down across Northern England into the Midlands and Southern England as well as we go through the second half of the night. Some blustery showers following on behind, but much clearer weather following that rain band south across the borders and down into probably the Manchester area by the morning. Well, that weather system lying across the extreme south tomorrow, keeping it rather cloudy. And these systems here will eventually bring wet and windy weather back tomorrow night. To begin with then, for much of the south, it'll be a cloudy start, rather a breezy start too, with patchy rain about, the more persistent drizzly rain down here in the west country. But further north, brighter skies, one or two showers, the heaviest showers likely over western and northern parts of Scotland. But those showers turning lighter through the afternoon, a bit of brightness feeding south, but the rain and drizzle never too far away from the extreme southwest. And tomorrow evening, the winds freshening and more rain returning. Temperatures tomorrow a little bit higher than they've been recently, but probably not feeling all that warm with that brisk wind. A fashionable start to Sunday night on BBC One. A new look for Compo at 7.15. Get the hormones jangling, kid. <laughs> it needs me. <laughs> Just for sure. A designer crisis at 7.45. I mean, what are we going to do about this new collection? Nothing tonight. We'll get a good night's sleep. Tomorrow we'll meet in my office. We'll go through all of these designs and we'll come to some sort of a decision then. Hello. <laughs> Dressing down at 20 to 9. Dorian in a cardigan. That's the end of life as we know it in Brian Close. At 9.25, a reporter seeks the truth in Telltale Hearts. Anthony Steadman has spent the past 18 years of his life in prison for the horrific murder of a defenceless child. A gripping story of love, hatred and murder with a chilling twist. Sunday night on BBC One. Now on BBC One, Screen One presents an unusual and sometimes disturbing film marking Halloween. Over the centuries there have been countless reports of ghosts and ghouls, but the line between fact and fiction has always been unclear. Using the modern idiom of the outside broadcast, Michael Parkinson, Sarah Green, Mike Smith and Craig Charles star in Ghost Watch. The programme you're about to watch is a unique live investigation of the supernatural. It contains material which some viewers may find to be disturbing. No creaking gates, no gothic towers, no shutter windows. Yet for the past ten months, this house has been the focus of an astonishing barrage of supernatural activity. 